I'll break through one of these days. You two will be demoted. And I become in charge. It's only a matter of time before that happens, anyway. I wonder if there is a Knights of the Nine fix, but it shouldn't really affect too much of anything, anyway. Oh, there it is, sir. Dawn is breaking. Yes. Well met. Hello. I need to get in. Goodbye. No, oh, you don't really tell me how to get in here. Well. Unfortunately, you're in the wrong place at the wrong time. Paradise awaits me. Oh no! What happened? Anyway. Alright. Alright, we're in. I have no idea what happened. I just saw him and then I turned around and he fell over. Well, I must be done. Take care. Yeah, I don't really care about sneaking in. Do I actually need to be sneaking in or no? Nope. <gasps> Squeaky! Pet, pet, alright. I hear you. Alright. Hello. <laughs> You really think you're enough to take on me, the Doc King? Hello. How are you two doing? Well, well. Yeah. The Holy Crusader. Goodbye. Yep. Well, I'm gonna try and see if I can find anything else that's really cool in here. What's this? I'm guessing that's the door to the outside. All right. Hello. Who's there? Hi. Oh. What are you doing here? Who are you? Dead. That's who you are. All right. Why is this here? Anyway. What is this? Random store room. Not very good. And you're dead. Who was this? A little training room, maybe? Very cool, very cool. Okay. Maybe up here is where I need to go. Um, the key. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, what's up here then? Need to key again. Ooh, a Daedra heart. Everything needs a key up here. It's almost like this is a fortress or any or something like that where everything needs to be locked I think this might be a different way ooh what is this a naga pole Great, the clan fear. Hi. Hi. I think the Varath guy died. I, do not fear death. I really don't. He had a weapon on him. Brain splatter? Yes, please. Alright. Since this happened to me, 
And I have no intention of getting stuck down there. We're just gonna do this. And I want to take a look at this brain splatter. Ooh. Very nice. Hello. Hello. Your brain shall be mine. <laughs> During my attempt to gain access to the fortress armory, I encountered and slew Lord Revan Ishtar. This is a stroke of good fortune, as now I can return the heart of the Stormora Lord instead of Farage's. Spell catcher. It's very interesting. Oh. I have the heart of the Dramar Lord. Now I need only to return it to the shrine for my master's ritual. Hellbringer. Cool. Alright, what do you have? Nothing. What do you have? Nothing. Yeah, you have nothing. I think this mace might be perfectly good. I may want to take the characteristics of this mace, throw this war hammer, and place it somewhere else, maybe. Who knows? Alright, so I think the armory is up here. I have a key to it, so let's go see what we can get our hands on. Let's see what cool things that the Mythic Dawn have in store for me. Or at least what this place has in store for me. So what's in here? Hi. Are you serious? A Dramora dagger. Eh, sure why not. What are we doing here? Hmm. Well, let's go and uh, repair our stuff. Actually, no, we can't repair our stuff. What's Hellbringer? Yeah, Hellbringer's not a, not that not too bad. A little stronger than Twisted Light. That's fine. Hmm. Cool. I opened the fortress armory and gathered up Farage's weapon and armor. They are ancient and don't look particularly battle-worthy, but I shall return them to him nonetheless. Alright, let's go. That's not where I came from. This is where I came from? Nope. And now I know where I did come from, though. I came from over here. Pet, pet. Alright. Not surprising, though, the Mythic Dawn have rats as pets. Like the vermin that they are. What are you not doing? That's a mythic dawn fortress. And you're a god. You're a knight of the nine. You should be dealing with them. I'd ask what I'm what am I paying you for, but I'm not paying you anything. Anyway. Is this to go back to Shadow Just Cape? Or Shadow's Cavern. Who cares? And... Oh. Alright, finally! Well, am I supposed oh. to be impressed? Take that! Come on. Repeat performance. Let's get this over with. <laughs> Repeat performance of last time, too. Alright, so after that crash... This is a little bit out of the roleplay train kind of thing. Uh, a little bit after the crash, uh, I restarted the game. And they started fighting, 
he won. I haven't even used my effect. So I was like, okay, I want to see if this guy's even stronger than this guy. And he did. So he won. And the game wasn't even going to load on OBS for some odd reason. So I decided to close the game and redo it again. And now it's time to load it. Yay. Since I like that whole battle thing, I want to keep it. Alright, but I have no idea why it wasn't detecting it really quick. It's kind of acting like what happens when I try to record a Pokemon Crystal kind of thing. Where it doesn't detect the application nearly as fast. Alright, there we go. How are you alive? Your brains are now splattered all across the walls. I don't even think a drill even has a brain. lag there but hey i don't mind crashes like that where i can easily anticipate like i can like anticipate it where the, like the audio just cuts before the video does because then i can easily just like stop the recording right before it like like right before it literally crashes what is it but sometimes it just crashes right out and it's like okay i gotta struggle to get the hit the stop recording button anyway battle gear i must say mortal i hardly expected you to return from that place and not only do you have my armor, but you say Lord Ishtar is dead? <laughs> you have fulfilled your part of the pact, and I will make good on my promise. Okay. When the time is right, I will arrive to assist you. Alright. Well... I'll try and see, uh, maybe after this, what I'll do is I'll take a look and find out if there's a walkthrough of, of this mod in particular. Just because I want to see what happens if you actually just kill him outright, because I have never done that before. Or I have, but I never really went too far with it. And I want to see if you can actually still beat the mod without him. I think you need him for the mod itself, but I'm not quite sure how far you need him. If that makes sense. Save a little, at least a little bit more now. All right. Uh, the next one is I have to go back. Right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, we're not that far, right? Yeah, we're not that far. We can just use this and just run our way over there. I don't need a torch though. I love the warhammer damage and speed. It's 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 appropriate. It's like the. Uh, the Ivalon Butcher's, uh, was it the Butcher's Cleaver or the Butcher's Axe? I think it's the Cleaver. Where it does insane amount of damage, though, but, like, you gotta nerf it in some way, which is usually, like, speed. If this bear had brains, it'd be splattered all across the screen. Anyway. Uh, like, it's sort of like what I did with Twisted Light, though, where, well, the weapon itself isn't really nerfed. It's, like, as overpowered as you're gonna get, kind of thing. 
like especially for like the conjured version like the conjured version is way stronger than this and has way like uh, is a little bit way over the top but for this though this is the nerfed version and even then like it's still like a little bit overpowered but it's overpowered in terms of the vanilla though I don't know if I affected the durability at all. Even if I did, it wouldn't really change much of anything. Like, damage has definitely changed. Uh, this sword actually has a weight, which is a lot for what it actually is. I mean, comparably, like, this is a Warhammer, so obviously it's going to be much more heavier than a Claymore, right? But, like, look at the difference between, like, the weights kind of thing. Look at the difference between, like, the damage as well. Like, it's... it's vastly different uh let's actually see how far this damage can actually go to i have a high blunt so this should be pretty darn interesting to see i'm quite curious how much damage will this do 94 so it's equal to the weight that's actually kind of interesting that's actually kind of cool and see like look at the difference between this though like I think this is normal though where the damage of the weapon i mean daggers are a little bit i guess it depends on the type of 